<laughs> Fabian, uh, thank you so much. I just wanted to record this video and thank you for finally proving once and for all that there is no loyalty left in football. Um, I've been a Villa fan for 26 years. I've been a journalist for seven now. I've written pretty exclusively about Villa on the last season at Loquacious Sports, a blog spot I've run myself. Um, I've worked for various newspapers and in all my years I've never seen such betrayal and I've never felt such anger. For, to go from a week of saying you were happy and you couldn't wait for the season to start to now turning your back on a club that has showed nothing but loyalty and commitment to you as a player. A player which, may I remember and remind you, uh, did not do very well when he arrived at Villa Park and has shaped, and in all fairness you worked very hard to become the great battling midfielder that you now are. But to leave for a club that is famed for, for ruining careers uh, because of big money moves, what else is there? You know, why other reason would you have gone? Uh, let, let me just remind you, you scored three goals in 107 appearances. That was a stat that was just handed to me recently. Uh, last season, John Terry scored five. You were a wonderful player at Aston Villa and you were loved. And this season, you were really going to make your mark. You know, you had England attention, you had a lot going on for you. And you've gone to sit on the bench. If I was you, I'd get in touch with Arsene, uh, and Mr Wenger, and ask him where he gets his trench coats. Because it's going to be a very cold winter for you, my friends, sat on the bench. Um, I think you need to take a long, hard look at yourself. I'd love, I'd love an explanation. I really would. And if you can tell me and turn to us and say there's anything more than greed behind this move, you know, you could say championships. Don't kid yourself, Fabian. You're a great player, but... Look at the quality around you at Man City. Do you really think you're going to break into that starting lineup? Where Where are you going to slot in? Who are they going to drop? I'm just beyond angry right now. And I think I speak for every Aston Villa fan, and most football fans, when I say, you know what, I really hope you see the mistakes that you've made and learn from them, because I don't know what else to say. But Fabian, I'm not going to be bitter. I'm going to wish you the best of luck. Good riddance. You know, Aston Villa have been around a lot longer than you have and will continue to go. We're going to march on up, you know. But this, you should be ashamed of yourself. To all the Villa, Villa uh, God, I can't even speak, I'm that angry. To all uh, fellow Villa fans, your comments are always appreciated, but uh, speechless, absolutely speechless. Fabian, good riddance.